outside of Neiman Marcus. Um, the niggas like right there at the corner. So like, look, T they wave down like, what's up? Like, what's that shit y'all talking? So we start. They chunk him up, Lil TJ chunk him up. So the the other nigga, so Lil TJ chunk him up with this one nigga, and the other nigga partner act like he wanted to box TJ. So I chunked him up with the other nigga, like shit, what's up? Like shit, if y'all finna box TJ, shit, I'ma box too. Like what's up? So shit, we start we start fighting, like bruh. I have the whole video, like the, the niggas, like the end, the, the video that came out, like on um the shade room shit, the fight outside near Marcus. I have the whole video. Like, we literally beat these niggas' ass all the way down the street. Like, we beat these niggas' ass. Bro, we was literally punching these niggas out, stumping their ass out all down the street, grabbing them niggas, yanking them down, beat, like, we beat their ass all down the street, bro. So, um, mind you, the fight happened. Cool, whatever. Me and Lil TJ go back to the hotel. It's back. The only sandwich. So A little bit, because I got to stop. Get to the room. He's like, hey, I'm finna go to my room and shit real quick. I'm finna chill for a little bit because I got the studio tonight. I'm like, bet. I go to my room. So Bay Swag end up calling me because I'm cool with Bay Swag. He like, bro, you got in a fight out here? I'm like, yeah, me and Bay Lee. Swag. <laughs> <laughs> Bay Swag went to my school. I don't know if y'all know Bay Swag, but me and Dude used to listen to this one song by Bay Swag. <laughs> what happened to Bay Swag? I seen him one time. I seen him one time outside my school. That's it. I seen him one time. What happened to Big Swag? What the fuck? Now nah, I'm curious. What happened to Big Swag? Look, me and TJ just whooped some niggas ass outside Neymar Marcus. He's like, bro, where are you at? I'm about to pull up on you right now. I, I know. Last time I seen him was with French Montana. Was it French Montana that he was fucking with? I think it was French Montana. I, I remember they was talking about it at my school. Y'all don't know Big Swag? Uh, he's some somebody that went to my school. He's low key a rap, like a low key rapper, low key. Right here, look. He went. What happened to him? I seen him with French Mont. Last time I heard of him, he was like with French Montana or some shit. Let me see. Base swag, French. Was it French Montana? Oh, King Combs. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, was it French Montana? I think it was French Montana he was telling me on Instagram. I remember there was talk about it. Gave my um, I gave him the address to my shit. To he my fell hotel. off. Damn. So, I'm signed to Rap Life. To I'm signed to. So Junior ended up calling me. He like, on, hey, boss. like you straight you out there, like you good. I'm like, yeah, nah. Some niggas end up just beefing with TJ and shit. shit. Beefing. So we end up having to um, fight some niggas, man. Um, so. Put your two on for three months, quicks. He was like, he was like, I'm about to send one of my guys with you. Out there to make sure you straight Trav, Trav MBB, shout out Trav. So he ended up sending Trav with me. He ended up he sent he sent Trav with me. So Trav ended up coming with me. He like yeah, little bro, you good? Junior told me to come out here. He told me you just got in the fight and shit and everything. I'm like yeah, nah man, we just these niggas was tweaking with little TJ and the stone shit, so we had to beat these niggas ass. So I'm like cool. So he was like I'm just gonna thug it out with you for the rest of the night. Appreciate you sure for six months, Jody. I'm like bet. So I'm like. I ain't gonna lie, That's I'm hungry and shit, Trav, let's go get something to eat real quick. So we end up getting in the car, and we go to Empanada Mamas. If y'all know Empanada Mamas, that's in this Empanada spot in New York. So um, I get in the car, we go to Empanada Mamas. So we at Empanada, we get the food and shit. I get my food to go, I'm like, man, I ain't really trying to eat that shit. And um, I ain't trying to eat that shit. I'm not trying to eat that shit in, in this Empanada spot. I'm ready to go back to the hotel. I'm gonna eat I'm just gonna eat in my room. So Trevor like, you ain't going out, you in for the night? Shout out my nigga sent with the five gifted. Trevor like, you ain't going out, you in for the night? I'm like, yeah, bro. Like, I ain't going nowhere. Like, I'm in the, I'm staying inside tonight. Like, we can do something tomorrow. Because I used to have a driver named Sam, but I ain't have my driver Sam with me. So he was like, you going in? I'm going in for the night. I'm like, bet. So look, I knew something was going to go down, right? When we pull back up to my hotel, it's me, Bay Swag, my homeboy B-Mac, my homeboy Walk, and Carl. It's us. And Bay Swag Man, it's six of us. We pull back up to the hotel. Like, I've just been getting weird vibes the whole time I'm in New York. Like, ever since the fight with TJ. I'm like, something is weird going on, bro. So when we pull up to the hotel, we pull up to the hotel right in the front of the hotel. I see a nigga outside the hotel like this. Like, I see a nigga. I see a nigga like that outside my hotel. So I'm like... I'm like, hey, bro, look at this nigga right here. Like, <laughs> like, look at this nigga outside the hotel real quick. 
So, Look, Mark, yeah, Trav, now we got the time. Here. I told Trav I was going inside. So he was like, oh, yeah, I'm finna spin the block. Then I'm finna go out then. So y'all just go back to the hotel and y'all be cool. Bug it, nigga. I'm like, bet. So I see this nigga like this. So I look. or some shit. Fully hooded up. I'm like, hey, y'all, look at this nigga right here. I was on point because I knew something I knew something was going on. Like, it was some Black Air Force activity for sure, for sure. So I'm like, hey, like, look at this nigga. So I tell the driver, I'm like, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't getting out right here. Like, spin a block, bro. Like, spin a block. Like, I told, like, I knew something was about to happen when I got out the car. So I told the driver, I said, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Spin the block, bro. He spent the block. Nigga, I wouldn't have hopped out nowhere near there, nigga. What the fuck? I don't even know why he talking about, like, I wouldn't have hopped out nowhere near there. Somebody, there's somebody fully hoodied up, blacked out, hoodied down, and I don't got nothing on me. I'm... Yo, I go lie. Yo, draw me out. Yo, Ain't draw me off like outside. like two miles away, so I'm bro. Like, I'm good. I ain't gonna lie, bro. That shit you was bugger, bro. So I look at my Cause like it was it was like a knife that you feel me? They got him with. But what if it was somebody with a blick, bro? Like you bugging, bro. Like that's a death wish hopping out right there. Dude, bro. I'm like, bro. Bay Swag, Bay, listen. Bay Swag was telling me this. Bay Swag was like, bro, don't get out the car, bro. Like don't get out this car. I'm like, what you mean, don't get out the car? He like, bro. That shit just weird as fuck. And I'm from New York, bro. And, and them niggas just standing outside your hotel like that, bro. Yeah, nah. Something's about to happen to yeah. you, bro. Like, don't get out the car. Facts. Nigga, I'm like, something about to happen to me, nigga. What the fuck you talking about? Like, nigga, I'm getting out the car. Like, I look back at my niggas, because it was only like two niggas outside at first. I look back at my niggas, I'm like, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Y'all already, like, nigga, we from Texas, bro. Like, y'all niggas already know how we get down, bro. Like, if these, if they trying to box, nigga, when we get out this car, like, nigga, we gonna box these niggas. Fuck what they talking about. Like, nigga, I'm getting out this car. Like, straight, like, I can call base swag here to tell you, like, nigga, I said, nigga, I don't give a fuck. Like, I'm getting out this car. Like, nigga, where I'm from, nigga, we gonna fight. So, nigga, if they trying to box, nigga, we just gonna box then. So, my nigga was like, fuck your shit, I'm with you, shit. Let's get out the car. So, shit, I get out the car. We all get out the car. I get to the door of my hotel. I get to the door of my hotel. It's this big ass black nigga though. He like, he look at me. He like, you good? I'm like, yeah, I'm good. Like, what's up? Like, what you mean am I good? Like, what you? Why, why are you asking me I'm good? He like, oh no, I'm just trying to make sure you straight. I'm like, oh alright. So I get in the hotel lobby. Open the door to the hotel. It's like two doors you gotta open. I open the first door. He was in like in a in a he was in the between. I don't the know first what he was thinking though, bro. He could have like, yeah, avoided that good? shit yeah. like. I open Popping the second out, door. thinking you gonna fight, like bro. When I open the second door, this big nigga, he say, "Hey," he he yell it out loud, loud as fuck. He say, "Hey, it's that YBN nigga here." I don't know where the fuck these niggas came from. I don't know where these niggas came from, bro. I don't know where these niggas came from. He opened the door and yelled at, bro. Bro, I looked to my left. Ten niggas running towards me. Look to my right. Ten niggas. I swear to God. I swear to God. When we looked at the footage, we looked at the footage, we counted. We counted 21 people, bro. We counted. We counted 21 people. It was 21 people. It was 21 of them. Nah. I swear to God. I put this on Sir Light, bro. I put this on my son Light, bro. It was 21 of them. It was 21 of them niggas. <sighs> bro, the niggas started running towards me. So my niggas, like... It was six of us. My niggas, like, y'all don't even know this. Y'all don't even know this shit. My niggas kind of made a shield around me. Like, they shielded me in the middle and they shielded around me because when them niggas ran up, because they was like, what's up? Like, what's up with y'all trying to fight or something? So we was like, nigga, what you mean? What's up? Like, so we, we ain't no hoes at this point. So I'm, we like, shit, yo. Charge up? your phone, bitch ass so nigga. Start scrapping with my partner, Walk. Like, he started scrapping, so what they the started fuck? jumping him and shit. So walk, look at me, like, nigga, so I swing on, I spark up, like, y'all don't even, I wish, like, y'all could see the hotel footage, like, the actual video hotel footage. So, nigga, they started trying to jump, walk, it was, I swear to God on my son's life. Low key? What if my mother, my phone's at 2%? <laughs> what if my mother, my phone's at 2%? Not with the Facebook politicking. Like, bro, it was 21 of them niggas. Nigga, they Yo, hold on. After the walk. So I spark off on one nigga that's like, he tried to jump walk. So I spark off on the nigga. Boom. Yeah, nigga. I, I hit the nigga. Mm. So then, hit that nigga. like, nigga, walk end up getting loose. So, nigga, the, one of the niggas got a bottle. Like, the niggas too have, much like, Hennessy bottles and fucking 1942 bottles. Nah, you like bottles. that. 20 that's niggas shit. and you still Pissy. swinging. I'm running. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I see it, bro. I'm I'm Jay. This nigga talk about nigga, this nigga talk about oh now nah, I'm punt no you bugging nigga. Twenty yo, somebody can say, 
oh, that's, the, if I'm Jay, right? I'm in Jay's position. They go, oh, that's that X nigga, right? And I see 20 niggas. Nigga, I'm, yo, I ain't gonna lie. I'm not even looking. I'm not even looking, bro. As soon as I hear that's that X nigga, I look back. I see 20 niggas. Bro, I'm not even gonna try to catch their face. No, I'm just running, nigga. I just look back. Boom, hitting jets. I got out of there. You bugging 20 niggas? Yo, like, what's up with him, bro? Like, why did Jay do Like, bro, Jay could have got up out of there, bro. And, and fucking... I guess it was his pride. But for me, 20 niggas, I'm good. Like I'm out of there, bro. Because 20 niggas, even without a weapon, they could still kill you, bro. Like, stomping you out. 20, bro, 20? They could... They could literally kill you without a weapon. 20? Like, you bugging, bro. I'm yeah, out of there. bottles and knives and all kind of shit. So the nigga ended up throwing this big-ass fucking Ciroc bottle and it shattered on the wall. So when it shattered, nigga walked like, man, fuck now. Let's get out of here. Like, run. Let's run. Mind you, them niggas, everybody. So we trying to run at this Please, point. Like, like, it's that, 21 the of them and six of us. Bro, bro like, I don't even know why he would hop out that car, bro. Yo, Mike, I tell you. Yo, what am I mother right now, Mike? If I pull up while I was in LA, if I would have pulled up to that to that hotel to the telly we were staying at, and I see two niggas at the door, fully blacked out, just sitting there, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna tell Minnie, yo, Minnie, stay in the car, nigga. We gone. We not, yo. I ain't gonna lie, Minnie. We gone, nigga. We are gone. We out of here, nigga. We not getting out this fucking car. We are gone. I'm telling you, that's word of my mother, bro. Cause me, we do not gotta say you bugging. Not chat that shit was mad to, funny. LMFAO. I'm not about to get. I'm not about to die. Yo, push the 100 bits. DL yeah, push it to one for two bucks, TJ. Yo, UX. As Glitch, they don't be thinking just do, bro, like, bro, I'm not hopping out that car, bro. If I would have pulled back to the telly, even as, as smacked as I was, if I would have, and I seen niggas like on, like, I know they on bullshit. Yo, bro, I'm not hopping out that car, bro. I'm not That's hopping it. out that Beefy. car. I'm not hopping yes, out sir. that car, bro. I don't care if people call me pussy, this or that. Yo, bro. There's one thing I always say, like, yo, if you're going to rob me, like, if you actually catch me, then my pride hits. But if I have a chance to avoid it, I'm avoiding it. You feel me? But if you actually catch me, like, that's the one thing I said, like, it was like, oh, what if you get robbed? Like, I was like, bro, if you're going to rob me, like, if you actually catch me to rob me, bro, you're going to have to leave me, like, like, unconscious type shit to actually rob me, bro, because I'm not letting go. Like, you feel me? Like, I'm going to start swinging all that. Like, I'm not, not budget, bro. You feel me? But if I got the chance to avoid it. I'm out of there, bro. We so got to get out of there. Like, we, at this point, we got to leave. Like, we can't we, we can't sit here and fight. We ain't got no gun. Like, none of that shit. Like, nigga, we got to get out of there. So, basically, it was like every man for they self at the time. Like, we all trying to get the fuck up out of here because these niggas about to fuck us up at this point. So, like, everybody start running. Mind you, they ain't letting my niggas and shit run by. Like, they main focus was me. Nigga, I had two chains on, Dior's, fucking this Amiri jeans jacket. Like, I look like a come up to niggas. Like, I look like a lick. So... My niggas start running, like we all scattered different places trying to get the fuck out the hotel. Like niggas hit the street, niggas trying to hit the street and run all Pitch kind of shit. Pitch two in four months, uh, so, Chris. Um, double clock, double clock, Chris. Pitch two in so two months as well, too. I'm so adrenaline TV. pumping so fast. I'm like, how the fuck I'm get out of there? So I start running. I had space, nigga. I had like a five second space in between these niggas. I, it was like a mail room. The hotel had a mail room. It's like a mail room. Like you can go in through this side and come out on the other side. I'm so crazy, bro. I ran through the mail room. Uh. Ran out the mail room to round to the other side and I hit this glass wall. The glass wall is like it's like a glass door wall. Yeah, but yeah, it's like yeah. uh, it's like tall exactly enough to hop over. I hit my but head. But when glass I ran to like the wall, before. I'm thinking the door gonna open. So nigga, I ran up to the glass wall and I pushed it. And I'm like, it clicked in my head like this door not opening. Like nigga jumped the fucking wall. So nigga, when I pushed it, it didn't open, nigga. So I'm like, fuck this shit, I'm jumping this shit. So I had to squat down and launch myself up to grab myself on the wall and pull myself over the wall so when i got on top of the wall guess how the fuck i got caught bro guess how i got caught my jacket got caught on the top of the fucking on the top of the glass wall my jacket got caught on the corner of that shit my I jacket got go, caught on bro, the corner and niggas that shit, end up bro. running and grabbing my ass off the wall mind you all my niggas got out of there like they focus is not on my niggas at this time like they want me. I'm the one with all the jury on. I'm the one with this, with all this fresh ass shit on. I would let that jacket on. go, bro. My jacket got caught on the glass wall, bro. So the niggas I end up slid off jumping jacket, over the bro. wall. The niggas end up jumping over the wall, grab me. I ain't gonna them. They jumped me, bro. It was like at this point, it was like, cause some niggas did chase my nigga. Like they 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 chase my niggas. They all didn't just come after me. But at this point, I'm getting jumped by like twelve niggas, bro. It's one on twelve. Like I'm literally getting jumped by twelve niggas. Like. Nigga 
homie, like big ass, like these big niggas, like it was big, like grown, like th mind you, now I'm 19, it was like 32 year olds and shit hitting me, like these niggas, they was, they fucked me up, like they jumped me, they, it, I was getting jumped by, it was one on 12, like my situation was like one on 12, I'm getting boom, damn bro, kill me, just trying to like fuck me up, like basically they were trying to kill me, so, so, I get hit, and as I get hit, like I'm like I'm bent, like at this point I get hit, like I don't know these niggas was on some gay shit or something. These niggas was trying to pull my pants off, like they was trying to strip me, like they was basically trying to strip me, like these niggas was pulling my pants, like trying to pull my drawers Preach off. Preach it two, all three, for six shit. months, sir. So, so them nigga, when I got real, hit, nigga, boom me, boom, he hit me. So when I hit, I kind of duck down, like I try to protect myself. That shit. When I duck Beefy. down, nigga, I see a nigga with this blade in his hand. Oh no! So I'm like, I know this nigga not finna stab me, bro. Nigga, when so I stand up to try to run out that hole, and nigga, all I feel is like my back getting like pressure in my back. Mm, mm, that nigga started like poking me, start stabbing me. Yeah, nah, they violent me for sure. Start stabbing me. So like when I, I'm getting stabbed, nigga, I trip like I stumble because I'm like, I know this nigga ain't stabbing me, bro. So I stumble trying to get out the door, and a nigga end up. The nigga end up swinging. I know that's a thing in New York. Like, niggas be trying to, like, yeah, they be trying to strip niggas. I ain't gonna lie. Like, no gay shit. Niggas be trying to strip niggas over here. Like, if, if they could catch you, bro, they gonna strip you and try to catch you on, like, video, like, in your socks, nigga. Like, you feel me? To violate you just so they could post it that you got stripped type shit. Like, niggas stripped you. You feel me? Got this motherfucker on my face. Like, the nigga, like, when, I, when they stabbed me in the back, the nigga end up grabbing me like this. Like, the other nigga, bro, it's 12 niggas jumping me at this time. The nigga end up grabbing me and doing this with the knife on my face. Like, hard. Nigga, hard as fuck. Like, stuck that bitch in right here. This is where he started at. He stuck that bitch in and dragged it all down my face with the knife. Like, the nigga buck Girl. 50 my shit. That's what they call it out there, buck 50. The nigga stuck the knife in my face and dragged it down. So I'm oh, bleeding out my face at this time. Man, like, nigga. nigga, like... I'm not unconscious. That's like, what I was saying. Like, yesterday I started... I was like, bro, that shit's not a joke. You feel me? I'll preach a problem for 11 months over, like... I never got blacked out now one time. Like, I never blacked out, like... But I'm kind of, like, out of it. That's like, it. I'm like, Beefy. damn, like, I'm just got jumped 11 by... Months I just got jumped by 12 checking, niggas, bro, got stabbed in my back, stabbed in my... Like, I got stabbed right here in my back, in my face. Like, these niggas just stabbed the shit out of me. So, nigga, I'm stumbling and shit. Like, come on, like, any nigga getting stabbed up, like, you gonna stumble. So, I end up stumbling outside. I stumbled outside and I end up just falling on the concrete. Like, I fell on my face on the concrete. Like, boom. Like, nigga, I'm fucked up. Like, these niggas stabbed the shit out of me. They still didn't let me go. Nigga, they came back outside. Like, they was really trying to kill me. Like, they were trying to kill me at this point. So, nigga, they came back outside, nigga. They came outside, bro. They came outside. I'm on the ground, like I was, I was really out of it, bro. Like I was, I wasn't knocked out, but I was knocked out. Like I was zoned out, like out of it, trying to like get back conscious. These niggas just stabbed the shit out of me, fucked me up. You seen the pic I come back face, outside, I'm it. just laid on the ground, bro. Like, and I ain't got no more life in me. Like, nigga, I just fought, I just fought with you niggas. All my energy gone. Y'all just stabbed me up, jumped by twelve niggas, beat my ass. I, like all my life gone out of me. So I'm just laid. I just sat down on the fucking ground, bro. And these niggas just ran up to me. And I'm like, bro, it One ain't nothing I can do no more, bro. got stabbed in the like, face at, at my, my school. Ass, bro. So well, not really man. start hitting me while I'm on the ground. Oh, I'll boom, explain kicking a bit. me, all kind of shit, like, boom. So now I'm like, man, fuck this shit. Like, I'm about to get up out of here. Y'all know the craziest part? Y'all know why I'm alive right now, bro? Like, I really think I would have died because the nigga with the knife started running back outside at me again. He was about to stab me up again. I think the only reason why I'm alive right now, It was now, like bro, the same shit, though. It was like the same shit. Y'all remember when I told y'all when I walked through the door? Like, the same way, like, he said, like, they sliced them like they went down it was like the same shit they slashed them like from top down not really my mans i wouldn't like you feel me i'm not gonna be one of them niggas like oh, no. oh that's my man you feel me but it was just one of my classmates i was cool with but it wasn't my mans like i would have chill with that nigga outside of school it was like i see him yo was good nigga like you feel me like that a big nigga in the gap and he was like hey you good and i'm like yeah like i'm good bro that big nigga end up running outside and getting them niggas off of me he ran outside and was like bro no let him go let him go let him go. Just let him go. Let him go. He pulled them niggas off of me. He picked me up off the ground. He's like, bro, I fuck with you. Get the fuck out of here. And the nigga, I just took off running, bro. I took off running back in the hotel. Like, that nigga ended up letting me go. Like, that nigga with the knife was about to stab me up again. Like, that shit was crazy. 
So I end up going back in the hotel, nigga. I fell out on the hotel floor. Like, nigga, I just fell out. Like, I couldn't, I didn't have no more energy in me, bro. Like, I was fucked up, bro. Bad period. So I fell out on the hotel floor, laid out. Bro, y'all know the craziest part, bro. Nigga, I was laid out on the hotel floor. The employees, the people that work there, staff, everything, bro, they was walking over me, not even acknowledging me, bleeding out my face, stabbed up in my back, all that shit. Like, them niggas didn't even acknowledge me, bro. They were stepping over me as if I was not laying on the floor, bro. Nobody Damn. said, excuse me, sir, are you all right, sir? Do you need help? Any Nobody asked me nothing, bro. So basically, if I would have died, them niggas would have left me there laid out to die, bro. Like, this is just a true story. So, so um, like, some time go by. I guess somebody ended up calling the police. So I ended up making my way. Like, nigga, I, was, I got up. Like, I got my conscience back. I got up. And I'm thinking these niggas about that. I don't know where they at. I look around. All my niggas gone. Like, nobody is there. I'm the only nigga there. And I'm like, I lost my phones. Like, nigga, my phones came out my pocket. I don't even know how I got my phone back. My phones ended up coming out my pocket. I had $12,000 cash. Them niggas ripped my pants open and took my money out my pocket. Like, nigga, they ripped my pants. Like, them niggas was trying. They was some on demon time. Like, they was trying to kill me for sure. So they ripped my pants open, took my money, my chains was gone, my shirt was ripped up. I kicked, yeah. I came out of my shoes. They stole my wallet. They stole my driver license, my credit card. They, they stole all my shit. Like it was all on, on me. So um I end up going, I end up making my way in the back of the fucking um y'all know the desk at the lobby in the hotel. I end up making my way behind the desk. And you know what the fuck they told me when I got behind the desk? This is how fucked up this hotel was, bro. When I made myself behind my way behind the desk, because I'm not knowing if these niggas about to come back and try to kill me or not. Nigga, I don't know what's, what's the shit with New York niggas just trying to stab niggas in their head, bro. Like, what what is wrong with niggas, bro? Chef G got crunched with a knife in his head, nigga. This nigga got stabbed with it, like... Manager of the hotel said, I remember Mo FaceTime and be like, yo, this nigga just got stabbed in the school. Yo, and he's showing me all the blood on the floor. I'm like, yo, like, what? To me, stab like he dead. He's like, yo, this nigga just got stabbed in the face. Ah, uh ah, -uh, there's SWAT, there's ambulance. Ah, uh ah, -uh. I remember Mo FaceTime. Excuse me, sir, you can't be back here. You're going to have to go sit in the waiting room. You had to go sit over there in them chairs. Like, you can't be back here. I'm like, I just got beat the fuck up, jumped in this motherfucker, and stabbed. And you mean to tell me that I can't sit behind this desk until the police come or something like that? Something like call the paramedics. I'm like, I need the paramedics. Call the paramedics. So I don't know. Anyway, the fucking the fucking police end up showing up first. The police end up showing showing up first, and then the ambulance end up showing up. So like, nigga, I'm bleeding out my face. They sit me down in this like restraint chair. They put me in this restraint chair and they buckle me up and shit. Cause my adrenaline rushing. Like I'm like, where are my niggas at? Like what the fuck? Like what's going on? So they end up putting me in like this restraint chair. And then, like, two minutes later, I just see all my niggas walk in the door. They're like, where's Jay at? They not even know what I'm sitting right there. And they look. I swear to God, my niggas start crying. Like, he bust up crying. Like, bro, what the fuck? Like, what the fuck? Like, why the fuck do niggas do that shit to you? Like, what the fuck? Like, I'm I'm looking at him like, what, what, what happened, bro? Like, why you freaking out? He like, bro, your whole face is cut open. I'm like, what you mean my face cut open? Like, where my phone at? I ain't got no phone, so I'm trying to pull my camera out in the seat. Like, your whole face cut open. So, like, the empanada mamas I ate, I end up throwing that shit up. Like, while I'm in a restraint chair, I threw up, like, all over myself. Like, what? Oh, in the hotel. Like, threw up over myself in the restraint chair. So, they put me in the ambulance and I'm coming. They put me in the ambulance. Like, at this point, bro, like, at this point, I'm still, like, who I am at the end of the day. Like, I can't, like... Like, niggas know, like, it's a certain code you got to live by when you go through shit. Like, no matter if them niggas would have fucking shot Don't me. Chat, like, the, thing, certain... the thing with New York is, like, like, all right, so niggas got blicks, you feel me? But a lot of niggas don't got blicks because it's not as open as it, as it is in other places to have a blick. Like, bro, you go to Cali, like, I heard you could literally buy a blick. Like, you got to, like, you could literally go buy. Can't do that over here, you feel me? Like, it's not that easy. To, you feel me? Like, Florida, I heard, like, if what I'm saying is, it's a little more strict over here with blicks. So niggas use knives. Certain code you go by, like you don't talk to the police. So I got in the ambulance, right? And the fucking a, a police officer ended up getting in the ambulance with me. It was in the back of the ambulance. Niggas still got blicks over and, here. Though. Um, he was like, "Sir, you gonna tell me what happened?" I'm like, "Man, I don't know what happened. I just got jumped, stabbed up." He like, "Oh no, you know what happened." Like he was like, "You gotta know what happened." Like 
you know what happened. You know what they did. He's like, who are they? I'm like, I don't know them. I like, cause at the point, I don't know these niggas. If I was to see these niggas today, if they was to walk in here right now, I would not know these niggas. It was some random niggas, like some clout chasing shit. Like I never Damn. knew these niggas. So, so like, niggas don't. I don't know if the police was trying to make a joke or what. Pop this nigga. This nigga told me this while I was in the back of the ambulance, stabbed up. He was like, oh shit, if you ain't gonna talk to us, we gonna drop you off right here on the side of the road. Somebody else gonna have to take you to the hospital. So I'm like, what the fuck? Like what not the Cali fuck? Not Cali, LA, about? Vegas to, type shit. I'm like. Nigga, I'm stabbed up. Nigga, you mean to tell me you ain't going to take me to the hospital? You're going to drop me off on the side of the road? Like, these niggas told me this. Like, these niggas actually, the police told me this. Wait, what? So, I end up getting to the hospital, bro. I got to the hospital. I really, I didn't. Bronx is crazy with knives and popote niggas don't play. Bro, I know. They be having, my, bro, they don't have be having knives. They be having, like, like, damn near swords, bro. They be having machetes. Like, they be having, like... Like, not knives, bro. They be having, like, actual... Face was... Some of them be having some crazy-ass, long-ass blades that you just click a button, that shit. Like, cut they be wild. I, ain't gonna they be I was wild. stabbed in the back of the head and shit. So, uh, the doctors and shit, they cut off all my clothes. They used a the little scissors. They cut my clothes off. The only thing I'm in right now is my boxes. <laughs> they cut off all my clothes. So, um, I just hear niggas in a, in a, in a um, lobby going crazy. It's my niggas. They like, man, what the fuck? Like, they won't let nobody back there. They done sent like 10 police up to the office because at this point, the police in New York, they figured out who I was. They was like, oh shit, like that's why being Almighty J. Like, so they know who I am, I am at this point. So they end up sending like 10 police officers to this hospital. Nigga, they not letting nobody in to see me and shit. So, oh, I didn't tell y'all, me and Dream was beef. Like, me and Dream got in an argument. That's the only reason why I wasn't with Dream. Like, if I was with Dream, this would have never happened. Me and her got in an argument, so she was like, I ain't, I'm going to see you later on tonight. Like, I I, ain't, I need some time to, like, cool down and shit because I'm mad at you. So I'm going to see you later. Searching for but some, we offer another path. Yo, bro, that's the Where one the thing I'm scared of. I belong. Like, Dream, that's, Awakened that was by a girl. Like, that's what United I'm, that's the... like, no, not Dreamy, nigga. Dream, but that's the one, that's the one thing I'm scared of, though, like. Cause you fight for like me. having a problem with somebody and be like, yo, like don't talk to me, nigga. Next thing you know, like that nigga's like could be dead or a critical condition or like fucked up. Like it'd be like, damn. Like, no one can take away you are in this room. what it means to be among the few, the proud, the marine. Even what's going on, nigga? W a l t a p twenty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like that was like the one thing I ended up flying to Texas and how the song "Let Me Breathe" came about. Which I didn't know. Let me breathe. I had that song made already. I made Let Me Breathe like six months before that incident even happened, bro. Like Let Me Breathe was already a song for niggas. So for niggas that think like, oh, he got out the hospital and went to the studio and recorded a song, Let Me Breathe. No, I already had that song. That song was made already, bro. That song was made like six months before that incident happened. That's the craziest part. Like a lot of niggas didn't know that shit. But that's what happened. Like that's how the New York incident happened. Like it was a, basically some niggas clout chasing, and they did that shit. And then afterwards, they went on the internet with my chain. Like yeah, we just jumped YBN in and snatched his chain and shit. Like and a lot of niggas was making fun of me. Like that I got my chain snatched. They was like ah he got jump. He got his ass beat. Ah this gangster nigga got his ass beat. He got he got his chain snatched. Until the video. I mean until the picture came out on my face cut open. Like when the picture came out on my face cut open, a lot of niggas was like. Oh, nah, like, these niggas tried to kill this nigga for that shit. So then a lot of niggas started, like, being like, oh, y'all yeah, niggas ain't right. Like, y'all fucked up. Y'all some pussies. Y'all jumped that nigga and stabbed him up. Like, he by himself for his chain. So that's when a lot of niggas started seeing that shit. Like, when the picture came out of my face cut up. Because at first, a lot of niggas didn't know that I got stabbed up. Like, niggas just thought that I got jumped and I got my chain snatched and shit. Like, that's what a lot of niggas thought. They said, your homies ran. Yeah, we all tried to run. We all tried to run. Everybody tried to run, bro. Everybody tried to run, but they they focus wasn't on my homies. So shit, of course, yeah, they gonna let my homies get up out of there. Like my homies thinking that I'm with them the whole time running back, but they focus not. They focus went on my on my homies. Shit, they focus on this nigga with all these diamonds and his money. This rap nigga that we know that used to fuck with China. He fuck with Dream. Like we about to chase clout off this nigga. So that's what the fuck happened. So they went on the internet with some. Nah, niggas is weird, bro. Top sticks is fire. Nah, but niggas is weird, like. Niggas is weird, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's what they be doing. That's what I was saying, boss. Like, 
they be trying to strip niggas. They said like, oh nah, like they I don't know if they was on some gay shit. Now nah, like over here they try to strip niggas, bro. Like niggas try to volley, like bro, like niggas be like if they don't if they don't smoke you, bro, or stab you up or poke you up, they try to like embarrass you like the most embarrassing way possible. Like, like you feel me? Like they try to like volley you, like strip you all that. That shit. Beefy! <laughs>